Hey everyone, it's Rajiv and welcome to my channel Rajiv's Reviews. In this video, I am going to be giving my book review of this very cute middle grade fantasy novel called Inkling by Kenneth Opel. The story starts off with Ethan, who is this normal boy who is struggling with his comic book project in school. His father is a very famous comic book artist who is now struggling to make ends meet because he has artist block. But Ethan does not have the same talent as his father and he does not know how to tell his friends in school that he cannot draw so well. Now, while all of this is going on in their house, an ink blot suddenly appears from his father's sketchbook and comes to life and starts roaming around the house. As the ink blot roams around the house, it starts absorbing text and pictures from books and other printed media and starts to become very smart and develop a mind of its own. As the story progresses, Ethan stumbles upon the ink blot and the two soon become friends and he names the ink blot as Inkling. The two then try to find a way to help his father get himself back on track. However, there are others who have also found out about Inkling and they want to steal him from Ethan for their own selfish purpose. I actually received an advanced copy of this ebook sometime in the end of last year uh, in exchange for an, my honest opinion. However, because of personal commitments, I did not have time then to read the book. So I purchased the retail copy of this book from Amazon and I read it recently and I just loved the story. This is the first book that I read by Kenneth Opel and I really enjoyed the story. The pacing is smooth and consistent and it covers so many things. The author touches upon quite a lot of issues such as plagiarism, stealing, coping with the loss of a loved one, bringing a new member into the family, just to name a few. I also love the character of Inkling. You know that the author is doing an amazing job when he takes an insignificant ink blot and he turns, in, turns it into this very cute and charming character in the story. Inkling is like this bookworm who loves to read and I really enjoyed the way he used to imitate the characters that he absorbed. I was so invested in the story that I actually got a little teary eyed in the end which I usually don't get in these kind of books. The climax where the hero fights the villain is gripping and it had me to the edge of my seat. Ethan is also a very good protagonist who is very responsible and tries to do the right thing. He takes the responsibility of his father and takes care of his sister who has Down syndrome. He loves and takes care of Inkling as if it were his own family member and he also has good intentions to try and get his father back on his feet. All the supporting characters are also very lovable and heartwarming. I really liked Ethan's sister Sarah and his best friend Soren who add good humor into the storyline. The villains are also very interesting and not as two-dimensional as I thought they would be. Probably the only thing that I feel that could have improved the storyline was providing the an explanation to the origin of Inkling. Inkling randomly appears in the beginning of the story and there is actually no explanation provided as to how he materializes. At times I thought that Inkling was the ghost of Ethan's mother in that form but at other times I also thought that he might have just been some kind of an alien-like creature. But now after reading the book I feel like it's a good thing that the author did not mention the specifics as to how Inkling came about and that he just left it to the imagination of the reader. After reading this book, I have added Kenneth Opel to my list of favorite authors and I will be definitely checking out his other novels. On a side note, the illustrations by Sidney Smith also add a very whimsical touch to the book. I like the fact that the illustrations are also drawn in a very blotchy manner in order to keep up with the theme of the main character. Inkling is truly one of those books that a person from any age group would enjoy and it also shows how one can overcome any challenges, however big or small it is, and how they have to do whatever is right, even if it means sacrificing something that they hold dear. 
For this reason alone, I would give Inkling a rating of 5 out of 5 stars. If you enjoyed this review, then please do like and subscribe to my channel. You can also click on the bell notifications icon to get notifications on whenever I post something new. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye! Thank you.